Well, hello there, guys. This is PZ64 here for another episode of a Let's Play Pokemon Hard Gold version. Now, today is just going to be a little gym day. All my team is fully healed up. Just wanted to make sure. I wasn't really trying to show you. But yeah. So, um, this is uh, the third gym, Whitney. This is third, right? Yeah. I don't know why I'm downing myself. I'm a cute little trainer. Okay. Nice. Uh, I'm going to be soloing with uh, our good buddy Renku here, just because um, we need as much experience as possible uh, for Renku. I want to get him up to the 20 here. That would be awesome. If you can hear a little bit of background noise, that's just my brother kind of walking to his room. He's being really loud at the moment. And I don't really want Fury Swipes because I actually hate that move so much. I don't know why I had that button held in, but whatever. Hello, ma'am. Now, um, this, uh, puzzle for this gym is, um, sort of tricky. It's not that bad, but I, I was confused the first time I saw it. Um, yeah, let's... Slave. You're actually you're not really a slave. Marsha's the slave, but you know. I should have stocked up, shouldn't I have? Go safe switch into Fiesta and just kill him off. Alright, so let's head back that away. That'd be a good plan, yes? Stupid dimensions being more difficult. Oh boy, it's our mother. How rich could this be? Hello. Oh, hi, Chris. How are you doing? Or how are you? Bleh. I found a useful item while shopping, so I bought it with your money. I hate this. But it's still a good way to save money, but she keep buying you crap. But you could get lucky and have her buy you a stone, so it's not terrible. Well, why are in the Pokemon Center healing up? I might as well check. Or not, well, actually, I can't check there, but you know what I mean. I'll, I'll go talk to, um, the man in charge. Whoa! Poop. Talk to this guy. Kabaya berries and um, a repel. Anything else? No more. So um, you can just stack up these um things your mother bought for you because they'll always stay there. So they'll always stack. So you could just let your mother call you ten times, then go and you'll just get ten items right off the bat. Where am I going? I'm too lazy to buy healing items, so I'm just gonna kinda do the all natural thing. I suppose. I don't know where I was going nowhere. I almost got confused again. Alright, so only two more trainers to fight. You shouldn't let your guard down just because I don't look tough. Okay, that. Alright. Oh, wow. Well. Um. You are not a nice person. You're dead now, so I don't care if you're not a nice person. Alright, so last trainer of the gym. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon, but I have a strong and a cute Pokemon. Okay. I, I don't really... I, I hate them just kind of sugarcoating everything. Get to the battle! Don't need your stupid beginner dialogue. You mean nothing to me. Wow, these Jigglypuffs are so threatening right now. Bruh! Disabling my head button. I, I think it might be good. Um, did I lose a lot of PP? Not really. Good enough for me to try to wing it, I suppose. Uh, let's save right here.
And, um, let's do this. Hi, I'm Whitney. You, I saw you at the radio tower just now. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Okay, so this is Whitney. I used to call her Whitney, I don't know why. I was like 9 or 10 though. But, uh, just uh, a amusing little anecdote for you. Um, so she's gonna lead off with the Clefairy, level 17. Um, this is probably the hardest gym you will ever face in this game. And it doesn't even matter about levels. I don't consider the hardest gym levels. It's where you're at in the game. Like, third or third gym is still an early time. You're still developing your team. So to get screwed over by a team that just is annoying is not fun. That's why I'm over-prepared. But unfortunately, I think um, her lead Pokemon is like... Well, I, th I know, but I don't know if it's defensive in both ways. It's ridiculously defensive. And it's not good for me at all. I really don't need you to miss now, Renku. Well, not miss, but get embolized by love. Alright, so down goes the Clefairy, the nuisance that it was. Now she's gonna send out her mill tank. Hate this thing so much. This is what screws so many people over. Mill tank, she's big, she's powerful, and for all you flying or bug type users, this thing's got rollout. We'll just screw you over. Now I'm gonna have to do a little slave action here. Just cause. I mean, and this thing's got stab moves, this thing has good attack. This thing is just not good for... <laughs> I don't know, it's just not fun to face. Yep, there it goes. That female Sandshrew sounding better and better every time. Hey, look, slave number two. Hoopla! I don't know why I'm wasting all my slaves right now. Cause I ain't got none revives. Aha, uh -huh. silly talk. I'm so silly. You know what, I'm just gonna kinda start fighting through the um, embolization. Because at this point, you know. Yep, embolized. Beautiful. Basically, I'm just waiting for Renku to die. And I mean, I have a revive if I'm in dire need, but I don't think that's going to be the case. Because you're just going to see Fiesta come out here and destroy, man. Fiesta's a pimp. So, we're just going to do the... A logical thing to do and poison. Oh, again? In an important fight like this? And I don't have any. Now, watch. He's gonna be poisoned. Or, or she's gonna be poisoned, but she has a berry. Which frigging screws me over. Now, we're gonna. I really. That's why I really hoped that first poison would stick. Oh, yeah, this might be close now. Oh crap. Alright, thank god. So now this poison's gonna stick. I mean, I still have a couple synthesis left. So that's also very good for me. And now we're gonna have to go out into Marsha. Marsha, you're so awesome. Alright, so, we're not immobilized by love anymore, 
immobilized, immobilized, whatever you want to call it. We can go chirping at this mill tank and just go out right for a synthesis. Now, I really need this synthesis to get through. Thank God. Alright, so we're in good shape right now. We're actually not in bad shape. Because we're beating them up with poison. Now, our easy way to winning is to get through with this ra razor leaf. I think that could just push us over. Because it's stab, we're adamant nature, and that'll push it to his poison, which will kill him off. What did I tell ya? Love when the plan comes together. Alright, so player defeated um, leader Whitney. And there we go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> you meanie. Alright. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She cries when she loses. What a jerk. What 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 do you want? A badge? Alright, oh, I'm supposed to give those things out when you utterly beat me. Yeah, those things. The plain badge lets your Pokemon use strength outside of battle. Oh, you can have this too. And I'm actually surprised, because Miltank didn't use rollout, it just kinda spammed stomp. I believe I believe it has rollout, doesn't it? I didn't see it use milk drink either, but it wasn't it, it wasn't out there for that long. Cause you know, Fiesta messes you up. I don't want to talk to you anymore. All right, so we actually um did okay this episode. Um, we got the whole gym leader done. We have three badges now. So a little head of the ball game. And um, next time I'll just be some roots and training. And all that good stuff, uh, maybe get Renko up to 25, start training up Fiesta some more, and that'll be all good. So guys, this has been PZ64, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Hard Gold. Bye.